Yeah, answer the question. The second thing is, you mentioned that the Quran can it talk about the Bible or the Bible talks about this is what you said, right? So the Quran actually talks about a revelation which was given to Jesus Christ yes. that is Japan. Yeah. Yeah. Allow me to complete yeah. no, The Quran was actually given no, it, does it does it talk about the does the Bible talk about the Quran? Though? Pardon me? Does the Bible talk about the Quran? You have to find out. You ask the Christian if the Bible talks about the Quran. You ask me if the Quran talks about the Bible. Okay, so I don't. Yeah. So that doesn't help me with anything. Yeah. That information yeah. is not good for me in any yeah. position. Okay. Because so if you say that the Quran talk about the Bible, I'll say no. Why? Because the word Bible is not there in the Bible itself. So how can the no, word no, no, Quran? No. I'm not saying the word Bible. Okay. I'm saying excerpts of the Bible were put in the Quran. Because the yeah. source. So yes. what yeah, we yeah, believe, yeah. so what we believe that there was a revelation yeah. which was okay. given to Jesus Christ. Okay. Okay. Well, I, you know what? I really do appreciate. You talking to me? Definitely. I appreciate your information. Yeah, I want to answer that for you, but yeah, yeah. So you have a, you know, yeah, at least a misunderstanding yeah. clarified. Are you guys gonna be here? Because uh, we'll have to go or? for the Juma Salah now. No, we'll have like, to go for the Juma prayer. During the week, you'll be here. Yeah, we come here once in a week. Okay. You okay. Know, if you can give us your number, we'll call you when you're. Uh, you know. uh, but what I will do is uh, I will look up information. Okay. And. Uh, I will be uh, prepared. Definitely. Yeah. So I'll just answer this for yeah, you, just no. so when you yeah. go here, you're you yeah. know clarified with yeah. uh, one misconception at least. Yeah. So we believe that there were books which were given to the prophets. Yeah. The Quran talks about the Torah, which was yeah. given to Moses, my peace be upon him. Yeah. The Quran talks about Zabur, the Psalms, which was yeah. given to David, my peace be upon him. Yeah. The Quran talks about Injil, yeah. the Gospel, the Good News that was yeah. given to Jesus Christ, my yeah. peace yeah. be upon him. And the Quran talks about the Quran which was given to Prophet Muhammad the peace be upon him. Yeah, yeah. These are the four books which are mentioned by name in the Quran. Okay. There were other books that were given to the other prophets. Yeah. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, he mentioned in the Quran, in one of the chapters of the Quran, yeah. in Surah Ghafir chapter 40 verse number 78, Allah says, that, O Prophet, we narrate to you the stories of some of the prophets, yeah, yeah. but of others we don't. Yeah. Okay. okay. So we believe that the revelation was given to Jesus Christ and peace be upon him. Okay. Because the revelation which was given to Jesus Christ and peace be upon him was the Injil, yeah. Whatever was given to Jesus Christ, my peace be upon him, is not preserved at all. So the Bible that you have today is a distorted and the corrupted form of what was given to Jesus Christ, and peace be upon him. Even if it was given to Jesus Christ, and peace be upon him, it was given for his time yeah. and for his people. Yeah. Because Jesus Christ, my peace be upon him, he was not sent for the whole of humanity. Yeah. Bible actually says that in the Gospel of Matthew, chapter 10, verses 5 to 6, yeah, Jesus yeah. Christ, and peace be upon him, says, Go ye not into the way of the Gentiles, enter ye not into the city of the Samaritans, yeah, yeah. but rather go to the lost ship of the house of Israel. Yeah. Jesus was only sent for the Israelites yeah, yeah. and the Quran confirms that. In Surah Ali Imran chapter 3 verse number 49 Allah says that we sent Jesus Christ and peace be upon him as a messenger to the Bani Israel. Okay. The Quran confirms that. The Quran yeah. confirms that there was a revelation that was given to Jesus Christ and peace be upon him. But the Bible that you have today is a distorted form. Yeah. It's a corrupted form. Yeah. Get you what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. Because, the, because there was not a dot or a doodle, yeah. a dot or a doodle that was written in the lifetime of Jesus Christ and peace be upon him. What you have today, Bible comes from the root Greek word Biblos, yeah, yeah, which yeah. means a collection yes, of books. Yes. What yeah. you have today, you have 40 different authors of yeah. this one book. Yeah. 40 different authors. Of, most of the authors, you don't even have a name to that. Yeah. Who wrote Romans? Who wrote Hebrews? Yes. You, nobody knows that. People yeah. just guessed it. Who wrote First Samuel? Who wrote Chronicles? Nobody yeah. knows that. Yeah. Right? So we believe that there was a book that was given to Jesus Christ and PSD upon him. But this Bible is a distorted form. This might contain, now coming back to your yeah. basic question, yeah. does the Quran not talk about the prophets which are mentioned in the Bible as well? Could be. Why? Because the source is the same. Yeah. Because the source, both the books, the Injil that was given to Jesus Christ and the Quran, these two were the divine books. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So this might contain, this might contain the, uh, the constituents in that. Yeah. Did I not say that? Because Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, He said that we gave the books to the prophets yeah. and the Quran confirms that. Yeah. But, the Quran does not confirm everything which is there in the Bible. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Why? Because the Quran is the Qur'an, yeah. is a criterion. Yeah. Okay, so anything that matches with the Quran, anything that matches with the Quran, we have got no problem in accepting that part to be divine. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Anything that matches with the Quran, yeah. we have no doubt in accepting that to be the word of yeah. Almighty God. But then, what about the other distorted, yeah, yeah, yeah. corrupted, yeah. You know, you know too, uh, I gotta go, man, but yeah, yeah, yeah. So, what you know what, I, yeah. I, I really do appreciate your information. Appreciate it, yeah. It's information for me. Definitely, so, definitely. Yeah, I want yeah. you to have an open mind and just read it. Yeah, but I'll yeah. just, uh, if you still want to have a copy of the Quran, I'll still yeah. give you. you. Honestly, if you want to give it. So, yeah, I just, I, I'll take these. Oh, okay. Cool. Um, Alrighty.
Yeah, I, I appreciate you. Yeah. I, yeah, you're very knowledgeable. Man. I'm not. I'm just trying to see this. These are just the basic yeah, things. Yeah, yeah. This yeah. is the basic yeah. things. Yeah. So what I said. But I mean, to me, it's the, honestly, it's all, this was all transferred by Prophet man. Muhammad. Prophet Muhammad. So, yeah, translated by man. Exactly. And so translated by man, but the, but the message of the Quran is revealed. Yes, for me, they could have been mistakes. But the mistakes are attributed to the human beings, not to God, because those are the translations. Well, you have to in God. Those are and the translations. That's so, the reason. I think that's the reason no, I said. I'm sorry, I shouldn't make take that position. 